We have Rachel here with Luxury Daily. Rachel, what do you think the study says about the future of luxury consumers? Well, I think that, you know, um, the economy is still kind of shaky, but I think that as, um, you know, things start to progress, um, you know, the election's coming up, stuff like that, and I think that this will all kind of change consumers' minds. They're going to be starting to spend more. Um, obviously, those who are well-off don't really care. Um, you know, the truly affluent consumer is never really in that much trouble um, if they, you know, they obviously have their, um, you know, their qualms about the stock, the stock market and maybe their assets and things like that, but I mean, they're, they're generally able to start spending um, as much as they can, um, but I mean, I think that the future looks pretty good, um, especially since spending is up in all 17 categories um, from six months ago. And what do you think that luxury marketers can do in response to this data to reach these affluent consumers who are positive? I mean, I think they should just keep doing what they're doing, um, you know, just using all the channels that they have to their advantage, mobile, out of home, print, um, you know, just keep, you know, just trying to build loyalists, um, get your affluent consumers, um, start spending again in your stores, um, and I think that, um, you know, it's looking really good. Great, thank you.